Hi ninjas, how are you guys doing? It's your girl Oh, I'm Nish Wajalu, aka Miss Fear Focal, running back for all entertainment. If it's the first time joining me, you're most definitely welcome. Please do make sure that I subscribe, never see hit the bell. I absolutely love you. Now, happy Monday, my people. Um, I'm gonna do my best to make sure that I'm actually filming, editing, and scheduling these videos for you guys. But um, we're gonna dive back into entertainment videos but i obviously had to um record this video because my blood results came back and um i just wanted to give you guys an update i honestly just want to start off by saying that guys thank you so much you guys have no idea you know sometimes you you, you can feel like you're just supporting you know because you're a ninja but for me it means a lot more than how you guys can ever think of you know or even imagine um i'm gonna go ahead and just start off by saying that i think i've said this many times that th there's no time that ninjas have ever dropped me like you guys have literally never dropped me and you guys make it such an a comfortable place for me to share because you guys are always just ready to welcome me in your hands um and i i will forever be grateful for that now if you're someone that do not know i just made a story time and i was talking about um you know how i got diagnosed with anemia and i was talking about all the symptoms that i went through and um i do have to say that you know i don't know what reaction i honestly expected but again you guys blew me out uh, um you know like you just I just I don't want to get emotional because <laughs> I know like I'm someone I feel like right now I'm actually a bit fragile just because of the trauma that I experienced this past week um it was very traumatic for me you know um like getting to a point where even just getting a glass of water from the fridge by the time you go back to your bed you are dizzy and your heart is beating so fast um it was really traumatic for me i'm not even going to lie and so a lot of you guys like just started telling me to say oh you know i mean i also experienced that you know i'm fine now this is what i did i got so many advices i got so many dms um just you know ninja sending me hugs and love and you guys sharing your stories with me um and just you know also trying to tell me like what um i can actually do um that can help so many advices when it comes to medical aid the plans and all the advice that you guys gave i saw and i'm super grateful for you guys thank you so much for constantly just making it such a safe space for me i know you guys you know you see me as queen ninja which obviously i am but there are times where i actually sit down and i'm like these are people that i've never met you know these are people i only know through online and the love that you guys constantly show me is something that i do not take for granted whenever there's a situation um and you guys just feel that there's some unfairness that is going on towards me you guys never cease to being like not with oh you are not gonna have that i have the best following on youtube and i feel like even on the internet hands down there's no project that you guys do not show up for me for even with the salon like i don't know why i'm getting into this because i just want to give you guys an update but i really just want to appreciate you guys because you guys were the ones that were coming to my salon you guys were the ones that were you know like if, like you guys always show up for me and may the love that you have for me honestly may god almighty bless you guys each and every one of you guys for me um when i pray i pray for you guys as well and that's the truth and i just want you guys to know that i love you so much and i know every time you know it's just all about stories it's all about this and that but i just want to say that i love you guys and thank you guys so much um i see it all 
<laughs> and i appreciate it all you know um i just i love you guys so thank you you know but um yeah the results came back and my iron levels are very low very very low um and so now today i'm gonna be going back to the hospital um and so due to the fact that obviously you guys know i did talk about the nonsense that is affinity health in my opinion um i obviously am canceling those nonsense i already made the call to cancel them and so i think the thing that i'm having now is that i can go to like a private hospital or a private doctor a gp or a specialist i don't know and then you know like basically look at the blood work that came back and then see sort of like a um you know how can i say this um a plan but at the same time i'm just like if there's ever a need for me to get admitted i don't i'm not willing to pay half a hundred grand for me to stay in the hospital for three days so thank goodness that with the blood work that came back my hb um was actually 8.4 so that's good at least you know because they blood transfuse from seven and below so now that it's saying 8.2 uh, 8.4 it means that it's going up and so we can be able to just manage it as it's going up right um and so i am on supplements right now um and i am drinking beetroot juice which <laughs> someone i saw someone saying that wine glass i feel like this just just for my mental health it doesn't taste too nice but when it's in a wine glass it just makes me feel like i'm taking some wines child and so also like you know the the supplements obviously that i'm gonna get and so today for you guys um i'm thinking of i'll rather just use the public system so that we can manage it if anything goes wrong i know that's why i'm gonna get admitted and so at least they will have everything in hand you know the disadvantage part is that i'm gonna have to wake up very early because the queues there they get long but at the same time i'm just like um as i'm sorting out obviously the medical aid issue and everything um you know that's gonna be fine and so um i i like you know i'm not gonna i'm just gonna get a slower help but i'm gonna still get help in a public hospital and so i'm fine with that i'm just like okay that's what we're gonna do um so yeah i think the other thing again that i was quite shocked with was the fact that i got dms from people that i'm close to you know like these are my friends obviously like from whatsapp and then you know they're like oh my god i've been expressing the same symptoms it never came to my mind that maybe i should go and check my hb and everything and so i am really glad that i'm helping some of you guys out there as well um and i honestly like your stories gave, gave me hope um that this is something that i'll be able to beat obviously soon a lot of you guys i saw were talking about how you were anemic and they found that your iron levels were just crazy low and all and so that's the same thing that is happening with me um i did get i'm sure i'm gonna put it somewhere here so that you guys can see um these are the stuff that were recommended for me to actually eat that help with iron and so now it literally all makes sense you guys because i don't know if i've spoken about this but something very strange happened with me after i got the fibroids removed i remember even the first time that i went to the hospital like for my checkup i spoke up to my gynecologist about it and it's the fact that the moment i left surgery i just didn't want to eat meat if you're close to me you will know this i don't like meat like especially red meat i just hate it the only meat that i was able to stomach sorry i've been burping a lot hey um the only meat that i've been able to to stomach is like chicken um like beef pork i just no worse no means nothing like <clears throat> i just know and so i don't eat liver at all like you know so those are the stuff that I actually have the iron that i need and so it would <laughs> make so much sense why my irons are so low because i'm not consuming anything that has to do with with iron 
and that's just the truth and so <clears throat> I think that with the supplements, I'm going to start obviously having to change a lot of stuff. I'm going to have to start cooking a, a lot more. Um, and I'm going to have to eat this meat that I literally just, you know. Um, but I think that one that I'm going to eat the most is definitely going to be liver. At least I feel like that's better than like red meat for me and everything. But I don't have a choice now. So if I want to be okay, then I obviously have to eat that. And so I'm going to. And I think that maybe just me doing this is so that if you are also someone that is, you know, feeling those symptoms, you can change your diet and start eating the stuff that I posted, obviously, that the doctor um, recommended. And then also, um, you know, you can just, I guess, I don't know, guys. But basically, that's what's going on. Um, I just can't wait to have my energy back. Because I feel like I've just been operating on low energy. And obviously, it's because of my HB and also the, the, the iron levels being low. And so, um, in Venda, they say, no, I or I me. So, once you know what is wrong, then you can be able to treat it. So, I'm already in the right direction. My baby sister is still here. She was supposed to have gone back, but when she heard me saying, I'm going to be going to the hospital, she was like, she definitely wants to go to the, <laughs> she, she's going to take, um, you know, a day off. Because obviously, you guys know that she's doing practicals right now. And my other sister, who is mom, a raised mom, um she's in venda and she was like i'm coming you know she was shouting at me today why didn't you tell me that you were sick no if it's us this and this and she was so upset and i'm like guys i literally did it for you guys because i didn't want you to stress and all that and i i also just wanted to go ahead and clarify because for my previous video i was talking about it was only js that was here i was talking about my sisters because i knew for a fact that the moment i say something they are here okay oh baby sister that is here she, i told her on friday i think yeah on friday that hey by the way i've been sick and oh girl was here okay so i do have a really strong support system as an older sister i obviously will always you know try protect my siblings um but not that i never ever would ask for help i obviously had all the help that i needed honestly and even more from js js showed up hey and so basically that is that you guys and so i just want to say thank you guys so much for just also sharing your stories and not making it awkward for me <laughs> you know where it's like oh you're sick this this um you guys came through also with your statements i mean with um what you had to say and the other thing again that i have to say guys is that the more like i'm taking the medication which i feel like now my hb is probably gonna be high i did also see the the hb testing machines and i think it's like 800 rands which i feel like it's pricey but it's not bad and so i'm definitely gonna just go and buy that and i'll have it in my house and i'm gonna be strict you know in terms of maybe every two days i'm gonna be checking are we going up because we're supposed to be going up 12 is where we're supposed to be um if it's at 11 then it's starting to get low right so I think that if i'm able to just test the comfort of my own home it's gonna definitely be better um and so yeah guys honestly i just want to say that thank you guys so much for all the love and all the support i do see you guys and um i love you guys and i appreciate you guys so so much um and due to the fact that obviously i'm not well i am gonna be posting i'll do my best to um my energy levels they drop hey quite fast so i can start a video like i'm all up and then all of a sudden it drops please just understand that i'm not fully well now if there are days where i feel like i'm not feeling well at all i'm gonna just go ahead and say hey guys it's one of those days in community and then obviously it means that i'm not gonna um upload i'm gonna try my best to not push myself you know to the limits but i'm also gonna do my best to just push myself to where i know that i can actually take it one of the best advantages that i have with the job that is mine obviously is the fact that i literally have to do my job sitting down like this the editing can be a bit strenuous but 
other than that honestly i cannot um complain so thank you guys so much for everything i am going to do my best to take care of myself obviously um and i also saw some of my ninjas like oh my gosh you've been going through so much since the beginning of the year um yeah <laughs> i've been dealing guys i've been i've been dealing but um i'm gonna be honest with you guys in in the fact that no matter what life throws at me as always for god has my back in everything um you know what are the odds that i'm gonna go to a hospital and the doctor there is a ninja and she's like you know making sure that i'm i'm okay um what are the odds that you know like with every single thing that just is happening no matter how or which direction the wind might try to push me girl i'm super cushioned um god always just comes through for me no matter what you understand and so i think that that's just i'm such a i'm a very positive person hey i think very positively and i think it also like literally comes back and so basically that is that um i think also the other thing is i share a lot and i think a lot of people go through a lot more than i go through i'm just someone that obviously you guys know and i'm very open and i share because i do feel like you know these things can actually help some of you guys and so basically that is that there's a lot that is still going to come obviously um whenever i'm feeling better i'll make sure that i just record as much as i possibly can and basically that is that so yes ninjas i just wanted to give you guys this it was supposed to be quick but guess what girl <gasps> i talk too much anyway i love you ninja stay blessed entertainment videos will definitely be coming after this one um and i'm excited about that hey and so i'll see you guys in my next upload bye ninjas